even though Ben Affleck and Jennifer Lopez have been broken up for months, sources say Ben still feels controlled by Jennifer and is reportedly living in fear of her during their divorce. Because Ben still feels controlled by Jennifer, it is affecting his dating life. They claim the two are acting civil, but Ben wants to push back against her claims. However, he is living in fear during their divorce because there's no prenup, you guys. And how smooth the divorce goes depends on them staying on good terms. This means Ben has to stay civil with Jennifer to avoid upsetting her. Ben is said to be frustrated because he feels like he can't fully enjoy himself or date as angering Jennifer could make the situation worse. This fear is why he quickly denied rumors of dating Kate Kennedy. Remember, I reported on that a few weeks ago. And it's also led him to pause any dating plans. So during their marriage, his main complaint was Jennifer being controlling. And now he feels like she's still controlling him even after their breakup. Insiders also claim Jennifer is willing to spend big on lawyers to avoid paying Ben in the divorce. But Ben just wants to move on and enjoy his life. But he's hesitant because he doesn't want to risk making Jennifer angry. The insider had this to say. Ben really wants to rip the bandit off and get out there and start having fun again. He's got so many women, hot women, blowing up his phone, but he's gun shy because he can't risk upsetting J-Lo. He's fully aware it's just playing into her hands, but what choice does he have right now? Ugh, oh, so dramatic, these two. Oh my gosh. So the frustration that he's having is, from his point of view, is that he's being held back from having fun and enjoying himself because he can't risk pissing J-Lo off. Who the heck is J-Lo? <laughs> so Ben's got no choice but to try and be as civilized with J-Lo as possible. Again, who the heck is J-Lo? <laughs> and who the heck is this source? Talking about he's got so many hot women blowing up his phone, but he's gun shy because he can't risk upsetting Shayla. What choice does he have right now? Oh, my gosh. The source is Ben, okay? It's like these two always play for tit for tat. And it's always a source, always an insider. <laughs> they are the source. They are their own source. They are the insider. Oh, these two drama queens. A bunch of drama queens. Anyway, Ben Affleck is going through a lot of changes after his divorce. He's changed his hairstyle several times. This time it's really black. He color it black. It looks good though. It looks really good. And you know, he bought a new house and is reportedly going to the gym more. Now his friends are worried about his latest habit, being a love addict. Ugh. Now, Ben is a love addict. I thought Jennifer was the love addict. Now, Ben is also a love addict. <laughs> they believe that even though he's sober, he may have shifted his addictive personality to relationships. Friends think he's playing with J-Lo's emotions just for fun, with no plans to take things seriously, which they say is not only unkind, but also confusing for their kids. You see, this is J-Lo. This right here is J-Lo talking, okay? Always the kids, kids, kids. She always likes to bring the kids into it when she's the one that's going from men to men, dragging these kids along. And these kids have their own father. I don't know why she's always talking about the kids with this guy. They don't have kids together. Jennifer doesn't have kids with Ben. Her kids have a father. Mark Anthony is their father. And Ben kids have a mother. Jennifer Garner is their mother. So I don't know why she's always talking about our kids, our kids. Lady, get a grip. 
And they were only married for two years. Well, less than two years. So these kids will be okay. They have Mark Anthony, their father. <laughs> It's crazy. So anyway, his friends are concerned. He's being self-destructive and falling into a toxic pattern that could harm everyone in the long run. Oh yeah, that's J-Lo. That's J-Lo. J-Lo is the source, the so-called insider. <laughs> you see what I mean? They love to play games in the media. It's tit for tat. Crazy. Anyway, Jennifer needs to get ready for Diddy's trial. After all, they said she was the GUN carrier. She carried the GUN into the club in her purse for Diddy. So instead of playing media games, if I were her, I would try to come up with some explanation because they are saying not only did she carry the GUN for Diddy, she also is on these freak-off tapes doing some ungodly things. So I don't know, you guys, but we just have to stay tuned. So yeah, that's all. What are your thoughts on Ben Affleck living in fear? <laughs> oh my gosh, I can't. I can't. Okay. Um, <laughs> leave your comments down below. Don't forget to like. Don't forget to subscribe. I appreciate the support. And hit up the notification bell so you never miss any new videos. And I will see you on the next one. Peace.